And usually we want to see the permeability and also porosity at the same time. So I will create another 3D window. So I can do that by clicking this one. I want to add another window, 3D. Okay, and now I will select the porosity. Adjust size, okay, like this one. I want to put it here. So this is for permeability. This is for porosity, okay? And then I want to track it, or sorry, I want to have, I want to see them simultaneously. So I can do that like this one. I will put, I will drag the 3D one, the porosity window here. Okay, so I have two windows. Okay, like this one. This is porosity and this is the permeability. I can move the permeability and I can move the porosity, but I want to see it simultaneously moving, okay? So I can right click or wait for a while. So I can do that by going to the general synchronized camera. Okay. And also here, synchronize camera. So now I can see they are moving together. I can see the perm X and porosity at the same time. And here we have the trajectory of each well. You can see we have vertical wells and the name of the well is there, okay? If you are not very comfortable, you can make the trajectory looks shorter and the name will be closer to the reservoir. I can do that by going to the wells here, wells. Okay, and then cut trajectory by depth, okay? Yeah, I will do this, like this one. And also this one, wells, cut trajectories by depth. Okay. All right, so far so good. Okay. And then you can maximize, you can zoom in, you can see. Let's say, yeah, you already understand that. Now I want to have only one window. I will right click and close this one. 